Did you know that healthcare cyber attacks have risen 55% with over 26 million Americans impacted? Today, we're diving into how innovative regulatory technology is revolutionizing healthcare compliance, what it means for patient safety, and why traditional manual processes just won't cut it anymore. And it's not just about the numbers. We're seeing a fundamental shift in how healthcare organizations approach compliance and risk management. So what's driving this transformation? Why are traditional compliance methods becoming obsolete? Well, the healthcare industry is one of the most heavily regulated sector in the world. With increasing regulatory demands, evolving data protection laws, and heightened scrutiny of digital health tools, manual processes just can't keep up. That's fascinating. Can you give us a concrete example? Sure. Think about a national healthcare provider network that was struggling with manual audit procedures. They were discovering violations only after they happened, during internal reviews or external audits. That sounds incredibly inefficient. Exactly. And here's where RegTech comes in. By implementing AI-driven compliance automation, they were able to monitor compliance in real time, automatically flag issues, and generate audit-ready reports. But isn't there a risk with relying too heavily on AI? I mean, we've all heard about AI making mistakes. You know, that's a great point. There was actually a funny example where an AI chatbot recommended adding glue to thicken a source. Now, that's harmless, but in healthcare, we can't afford those kinds of mistakes. Right. Healthcare mistakes could be life-threatening. That's why organizations like the Joint Commission and the Coalition for Health AI are developing specific guidance for healthcare AI implementation. They're focusing on trustworthy AI principles and proper oversight. Let's talk about cybersecurity. It seems to be a major concern. Absolutely. The FDA just updated its cybersecurity guidance for medical devices in June 2025, emphasizing the need for robust security controls throughout the entire product lifecycle. What prompted this update? Well, cyber incidents have been rendering medical devices and hospital networks inoperable, disrupting patient care across healthcare facilities globally. That's concerning. How are healthcare organizations responding? They're increasingly turning to regtech solutions that use AI and machine learning to monitor access logs, flag unauthorized data usage, and ensure compliance with HIPAA and other regulations. But getting staff to adopt new technology can be challenging, right? Absolutely. The Virginia Department of Health's experience is actually quite instructive here. Oh, what happened there? Their CIO, Suresh Sundarajan, found that successful implementation wasn't just about rolling out new tools, it was about showing value and involving workers in the process. Because people support what they help create? Exactly. And the results were impressive. Staff who were once pure database administrators are now transitioning into cloud architect or automation engineer roles. So it's actually creating new opportunities for workers? Yes, and that's a crucial point. RegTech isn't about replacing humans. It's about augmenting their capabilities and freeing them up for higher value work. Let's talk about some success stories. Any notable examples? There's a fascinating case study where automation reduced CRF processing time by 95% from 150 manual hours to just eight hours. That's incredible. And the quality? Actually improved. The automation tool processed the case report forms with zero quality control issues. It seems like RegTech is becoming essential rather than optional. Absolutely. Organizations that don't adapt risk falling behind in an increasingly data-driven regulatory environment. What about smaller healthcare organizations? Can they implement these solutions too? Yes, and companies like Iratech are making it more accessible by offering scalable AI-powered compliance solutions. Tell us more about what these solutions actually do. They handle everything from AI compliance automation and risk management to regulatory reporting and audit management. And this all happens automatically? Well, it's not quite set it and forget it. You need proper oversight and governance frameworks, but it does dramatically reduce manual work. What about data privacy? That's a huge concern in healthcare. Absolutely. These systems are designed with privacy by design, incorporating encryption, biometric authentication, and blockchain-based records. Blockchain? How does that help? It creates an immutable audit trail, making it impossible to alter records without detection. This is crucial for maintaining regulatory compliance and trust. Speaking of trust, how do patients benefit from all this? They get better protection of their sensitive data, more consistent care delivery, and fewer errors in their medical records. And healthcare providers? They can focus more on patient care instead of paperwork, 
reduce compliance costs and minimize their risk of regulatory violations. It sounds like a win-win situation. It is, but the transition requires careful planning and change management. What should organizations consider before implementing RegTech? They need to assess their current compliance processes, identify pain points, and ensure they have the right infrastructure and training in place. And staff buy-in is crucial, right? Absolutely. As we saw with the Virginia Department of Health, success depends on showing value and involving staff in the process. What about the future? Where is this all heading? We're moving toward a future where compliance becomes proactive rather than reactive, with AI systems predicting and preventing issues before they occur. That's quite a shift from traditional compliance methods. It is, and it's necessary. The complexity of healthcare regulations is only going to increase. Any final thoughts for our listeners? RegTech isn't just about automation. It's about transforming how we approach healthcare compliance and patient safety. And organizations that don't adapt? They'll find it increasingly difficult to keep up with regulatory demands and maintain competitive advantage. It seems like the future of healthcare compliance is already here. Yes, and it's powered by AI, automation, and a commitment to better patient care. Well, that brings us to the end of today's episode of Copilot Podcasts. Remember, in healthcare, compliance isn't just about following rules. It's about protecting patients and enabling better care through technology. And with RegTech, we're not just making compliance easier. We're making healthcare safer and more efficient for everyone. Thanks for joining us today. Until next time, keep innovating and stay compliant.